or very obvious targets. And the hatred is out there. And it's not going to go away because we had one meeting now. I think the mayor heard the concerns, wants to deal with the concerns. The mayor's meeting with Jewish leadership was closed to cameras, but those who spoke after say there was a frank exchange of ideas centered around preventing and deterring more attacks in predominantly Jewish communities. They requested more police presence, the teaching of acceptance in schools, and even tweaking the state's new bail reform law when it comes to suspected hate crime arrests. There is a chance now for the legislature to get it right. They did some very good reforms, but there's also things that need to be done, particularly empowering judges to determine if someone poses a threat to the surrounding community and giving judges the power to act on that. This is a reality that we refuse to accept. Just hours earlier inside the Museum of Jewish Heritage, a living memorial to the Holocaust, most of New York City's congressional delegation gathered to announce 90 million in federal grants for religious nonprofits to defend against hate through extra security and cameras. But it was also about speaking out for this diverse group of civic leaders. We We've got to all come together to make sure that we do everything, leave no stone unturned, to get rid of this cancer that is eating at our society.